November 23rd. We are driving, doing another river float. Very excited, had to do some repairs to the boat. That was a project, but it was fun. We got through it. Wanna take a minute and brag about my best buddy Tom for hanging in there, hunting hard, and just being a great friend. I uh, love having him around. I'm excited to be on the water with him tomorrow. Try to shoot some deer, try to capture it on film, and just enjoying the process. Uh, good chance we may get some snow tomorrow while we're on the water. Pretty excited about that. Um, hopefully the boat doesn't leak. 50-50 eh, chance. It's probably going to leak. But we got waders and we bought some new boots. What else do I got for you? Um, ultrasound this morning. Um, that was the second time I got to see my baby girl. So it was awesome. My wife and I had a doctor's appointment. And excited for the future. Uh, it's beautiful out. Good weather tomorrow. It'll be super cold. And we're going to grind it out. Try to do some pushes. Try to float nice and silent. I would like to reiterate, like I have before, uh, what we're about to do is 100% legal. It is in clear, plain text uh, in the rule book. I have also called many different municipalities and confirmed its legalities. Uh, we have life jackets, we have everything we're supposed to have. Um, as far as the property we're hunting, it is public land, at least on one side, and most oftentimes on both sides. We are not trespassing, we are not doing anything illegal. Please do not leave negative comments. Um, let's go shoot some deer. Hopefully the next footage you see is us on the water tomorrow morning. Thanks for joining us. I seen main beam and two times like it, it looked like a big buck. All right, amateur hour. I'm tired of it. Acting like a bunch of rookies out here on the river. No more. Drawing the line. I've had enough. I'm fed up. We're gonna blow something up. That's all I got for you right now. Actually, no, it's not. I. Uh, <laughs> We saw four deer so far, and uh, trying to make it happen, been close, but we gotta close that deal, so it's coming, get ready. I think we're at breaking point, buddy. I think it's gonna work. Countdown. I think this next point is like, really, really hard to get to. I don't think there's a road for like two miles. I don't want to push it. I measure it three, three, four yards. Length is going to be 314 yards. Nice. 314 yards and the width 100 yards wide. Perfect. Should be really good. So I'll drop you off right here, and then I'll go around here and push that. Our wind's blowing this way, which is, I think like this way. 
Yeah, it's coming off the side. So it should have crosswind. It should be really good. It should be blown out into the water. Mm -hmm. I feel like it's gonna happen, buddy. I feel lucky. I put the lucky shirt on today. I feel like our boat's uh, lucky shirts on. You got to, I should probably show you show that off a little bit. Too many, too many zippers. Too many. I feel lucky. Doing deer drives. I just heard Tom shoot. All right, hope we got him. That's the best feeling. Grinding and pushing and hearing that shot go off. Good job, buddy. Hope you got him. Holy crap. I think you got it. Oh, my goodness. Thomas smoked it. Walked right up. You hit it in the head. Wow. Giant doll. Pushing, baby. Cowbell picked some bushes out on Onyx worked great. It was ridiculous. They busted me 20 yards out and they were totally trapped. They had nowhere to go. They didn't know what to do. She stopped and all I could see was her head. Put the crosshairs on her head, dropped her. The other two panicked. They ran right behind me. Hammered her perfect. Wow, dude. Dude, congratulations, man. Yes. That's freaking awesome. She's a huge doll. This. <laughs> I'm done with my 12 gauge. This gun is like sniper mode. No kidding, man. Dude, she stopped. She was doing one of these numbers, and all I could see was from here up. And literally, I was like, dude, I can take that shot. Pow! Dropped her, and she was like, just folded. I'm like, dude, it's perfect. The other two got in the stick it, and they stood here, and they didn't know what to do. And I'm like, you're going to run right by me or jump in the river. Like, you ain't got a choice. And they ran right by me. No tracking required. <laughs> It worked just like it was supposed to, dude. It worked so perfect. I mean, the wind was blowing from you to me. Yeah. Like, absolutely perfect. Thomas, he's a killing machine. Yeah, baby. Man, that guy, he's a natural. Look out. So. We got deer down, baby. One, two, three, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, I like that one. All right, man. Kel did all the homework. He did all the hard work. I just shot the deer. Uh, we went on Onyx, picked out some some good pushes, some big peninsulas, and Kel's like, this is where we need to be. He dropped pins, and he was spot on. Uh, we're not having great odds today. Uh, I missed a buck, and then uh, we shot at a buck a couple times, and uh, missed that one, and then um, did this push, had a couple does run out, and had a clear shot at her, took it, and uh, that's it. We're, uh, we're going to hurry up, make quick work of her, get her in the boat, and uh, keep moving down the river. So far, we've seen quite a few deer today. It's been good. It's been really good. Yeah, great day. we got more action coming, and uh, we're going to shoot some more deer, I think, yet today. So I think so. Thomas, the assassin, always knocking them things down. Yeah. Kel does all the work, and I shoot them. It's great. <laughs> we're a great team. <laughs> leaking we worked on it for eight hours caulking fixing rivets patches and we're taking out a lot of water we've learned that instead of working so hard trying to fix a leaky boat just buy a good pump so we got a pump pump the water out it's like the boat don't even leak 20, 22 dollars on amazon that's your uh, real tree tip of the week <laughs> best 20 bucks ever <laughs> Yeah, that was a... Uh...
Oh my god, it is unreal. What's up? Big giant scrapes. I stepped on scrapes and there's rubs all the way from that point all the way back here. You did a great job. I could hear you going back and forth. I went from bank to bank. Yeah. I like that head there, dude. On this yeah. hilltop, I had, I, you could see the river over there. Like they didn't get by. No. They just weren't in there. I was listening to see if they double back on me. But I kept like 20 yards and then I'd zig 20 yards and I'd like back and forth. We need to uh, hang stands back here. It is phenomenal. I mean, like just perfect in there. I don't think you can get back here. I'd take the boat in. Yeah. Even more of a reason. No one else does it. Yeah. It's gorgeous. The uh, next one's going to be super good across the river. With that point right there. It's All right there. It's going to be super good. There's a couple rubs back there. Trees that big around. Really? Yeah. Goodness. There's more than one buck in there. There's scrapes everywhere. Wow. Thanks, dude. You did a good job. You just covered it all. There should have been deer bedded in there. Like, there's not a ton of deer, but there should have been deer bedded in there. Super fish. Wow. It's all public land. Someone might have pushed it yesterday. Yeah. <laughs>